the people side of project management is the most important impact piece. Right? And so those of us that don't have that as a natural thing need to go and eject how to influence and influence people into their brains to think more like that. So I'm going to introduce two characters uh, here. Sorry, John <laughs> and Jill. Um, so John is very much me at that stage, just before the meningitis. Hard work, nailing projects, doing the things like he's done his PMP. He's you know he's a he's a project manager managing the project, but he's stop, he's struggling a bit and he's not particularly impactful. And then you've Jill who is that impactful project manager. What she does with her time makes a difference. And that's where I think the difference between good project managers and bad project managers, or, or people who find the stress and, and end up in the, the difficult situations, is how you spend your time and how you use the resources that you have available to you. The people side of project management is the most important impact piece. Right? And so those of us that don't have that as a natural thing need to go and eject how to influence and influence people into their brains to think more like that, right? to be more about pe people and humanity. So yeah, I think, it, I think there's, an interesting, uh, there's an interesting point there, like find your weakness and fill it in. Right? I know I'm kind of on the, I'm slightly on the autistic spectrum, I like detail, I like do the things to happen one after the other, but I kind of forced myself because I thought it was going to be good for my career to figure out how to understand people and how to work with people. And I still do it almost as a little bit of a mechanical thing. And now it works and it becomes very much more natural when you, when you practice it over time. But I think if you choose how you spend your time and how you can learn about things, that can make a big impact.